Don't do it. Don't look this direction. Do not look in this direction. Do not look. There's only 13 seconds left remaining. Do not look in this direction as you look right over here, right over here, right... What's going on guys? My name is No Game. Welcome back to a new episode of Modern Warfare Finding No Game. And recently, you guys have been begging and pleading in the comments for another episode of Finding No Game. So here we are, back here once again, trying to find out if we have the best glitches, if they're actually gonna work. But for the people that are 100% new to Finding No Game and have no idea what it is and how it goes down, it goes a little bit like this. There's gonna be 19 of them on one team. And then there's me. When the time clock in the lower left hand corner does hit 20 minutes exactly, that is when all 19 of them will be firing their weapons up in the air, coming after me, trying to find me in my glitch spot, which hopefully they don't do because the next three spots that we have, or the next two, I should say, after this one, are actually pretty amazing. But if any of these players at any point in time take me out today with their melee weapon in the next three maps, they will be advancing to the final round, which is the melee battle, and that will determine who's gonna be winning in all this today. But I feel like, you know what? Being way out here outside the map and kind of just hanging out right here underground maybe would be even better because i can slide into the spot right here that's actually going to be like you know helping me a lot more but i want to see if you guys can break a like goal that's going to be by far the biggest one i need your help more than ever today by hitting that like button to help me win in all of this i want to see if you guys can break this impossible like goal of thirty-five thousand likes we have never had a like goal this big ever and i think this one for real is going to be impossible like there's no way that you guys will ever break this one but if you guys do want to see more finding no game on cold war or even mw smash that like button but right as of right now I i'm feeling pretty good about this spot but for the people that do enjoy playing along at home you guys can see the board on the left hand side this is all 19 of them in the game right now so if you guys want to vote for somebody whoever you guys think is going to win in all this today put their name down in the comment section down below and as always if you vote me no game i'll be hearting every single one of your comments if you just type no game and vote for me i'm gonna uh, heart your comment down in the comments so uh, hopefully you guys are voting for me as you can tell right now in my voice i am very nervous because i don't like finding no game with no glitches because we have nothing left but also if you guys haven't already i do have a g fuel code that is 30 percent off right now code no game and if you guys use my g fuel code and tweet me a picture over on twitter i'll be liking that comment also so go ahead pick up some g fuel and let's try to get this dub today but let's get down to that 20 minute mark and see how today's really going to turn out now with time finally winding down, I decided to actually make this spot a little bit harder in a way just because I, I don't feel safe. But there's a 20 minute mark right there. So they're gonna be firing their weapons up in the air and coming after me, but still, I still wanna change up my spot just a little bit though, because like I said, it, it just, I don't feel safe. And I feel like this is gonna be even better just to change it up a little bit. I need to quickly do this before we mess this up. We cannot mess this up. We have to hit this today. We have to hit this extra part to the glitch, but like I'm slipping, I'm, I'm, I'm freaking out. I need to stop and just relax. Just do what you do, no game. Do what you do best. Do what you do best and just lay down and creep up the mountain just like this. This is perfect though. I, I, I'm so scared for our first round back here for episode 101 of Finding No Game. Like episode 100 was crazy, but like I was saying, today is gonna be the crazy day because like they, they know the glitches I'm doing. They know what they can try to do. But like I'm trying to creep up to the edge where they can't see me. They're going to be checking outside the map. They're going to be doing their little glitches. They're going to be running around the map trying to find out where I'm hiding. But so far, being one minute into this now, we're relaxing. We're chilling. I'm going to calm down a little bit just because like episode 101, we don't have any crazy wall breaches. But we do have some high up spots that might potentially work today. I'm just going to wait here and see if anybody runs outside the map. So only with being a few minutes into this right now, I can already see them running outside the map. I don't, I don't like this one bit. I understand, though. This glitch is kind of old right now. Running outside of broadcast, if you do know about it, the glitch has been out for a very long time. But the only way to do this glitch is they have to run across the road, right where they're running, right there. And then they can go up the hill over there. I don't think they're going to know about coming over here like I did from the road and then, like, run up this rock and everything like that. It, the small details, though, that you add to the hiding spot make it easy even better like I don't think they're gonna look all the way over here as I just saw a big flash of light over there on the side of the mountain they're definitely trying stuff over there as long as they stay on that side of the map and don't decide to run this way we we, we should be pretty fine um ultimate full flawless I, I don't think it's gonna happen I'm already freaking out because they're already doing the glitch we definitely have a lot of good players in here today 
Now, this is something I've never seen before. Um, I do not have the spotter perk on right now, but do you see the le like the yellow dot? I, I swear to you, I don't have spotter. I have battle harden and like ghost in double time. But there was just a yellow thing on my screen saying that they're shooting outside them. I'm not cheating, okay? Don't say I'm cheating. We've had players in these lobbies the past two finding no games cheat like crazy. And I really hope that that is not going to pop up on this side of the map where they're thinking that I'm over here. I, I really hope this is not a thing right now. If that's a thing, it's going to ruin me. And they're definitely going to figure this out and run this way as that dude just jumps off the map. I don't know what that yellow circle was, but I'm promising you, I don't have spotter or anything like that on. Now, I'm not going to say I don't know how they know exactly where I'm at right now because I am all the way outside of the map. The last thing that is going to be helping me right now, this very second, is um, them not climbing up the rock. Like I said, that little tricky part, how you have to like back up onto the leaves and then you can strafe over to the rock and then strafe over here as they're shooting their guns. That is the last thing that is going to be saving me at this point from helping me get this ultimate full flawless as they're jumping. This isn't good. Yeah, this really isn't good. Yeah, this is not working. This is not good at all. Okay, we might have to panic, but the only thing is I have nowhere else to go. I might be able to run all the way back over to the other side of the mountain, but I don't think that's going to save the day today. Two minutes left remaining. I am freaking out like crazy right now. Oh, no, that's not good. That's not good. We might have had one. Just figure out how to do it. I think he did. I think he did. But he's like crouching there. He's not sure what to do. He's coming. He's coming up the rock. He's already up here. Oh, and he just fell. Oh, this is good. Oh, this is too good. So they definitely know, definitely know where I'm at. Please, if I have to run, I am going to run. I don't, I really don't care. I really don't care. We have under a minute left remaining right now. One player looked directly at me, but I don't think he could have jumped up the rock or something happened right there where he couldn't make it up. Oh man, I'm, I don't know what to do. This music is too loud right now. I don't know why my headset is so loud. The music is really not helping with the shakes. Like I'm having my controller in my hand and the controller, wait. Oh, no. Please don't jump up. Please don't. Oh, oh, did he fall through? Yes, Arch falling through right there. Arch almost getting up here. 30 seconds left remaining. It is quiet down so much. I'm sorry for talking so much, okay? You got to understand. This is finding no game. I'm freaking out. The players are right here in front of me. This is not the way it's supposed to work. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't look this direction. Do not look in this direction. Do not look. There's only 13 seconds left remaining. Do not look in this direction as you look right over here, right over here, right now. And no, I'm insane taking me out of here with only a few seconds left remaining. There's no way. The sticks are so overpowered. He should have never got me right there. It's so unbelievable, man. It's the biggest ripoff ever to have the sticks. I'm done. Let's get over to our next map and see if we can continue this win today as we have I'm insane advancing to the final round. Now here we are guys on our very next map, which is gonna be on Hackney Yard. And I do have an amazing spot that I really don't think these players are gonna be able to get only because you have to like line yourself up with this stuff and everything like that. I highly doubt they'll get this, but you guys did see in the last round that a player did take me out of here, which means that the ultimate full falls isn't happening anymore. But it, it came out that he was actually cheating with a modded class. I was wondering why I saw the little yellow pings everywhere and I was wondering how they found me over in that area, made it over there. So we still to this day, have players cheating and finding no game just by having whatever modded class that was with the yellow circles popping up i guess they were pinging pinging me and finding me and i don't know how they did it but this glitch i'm doing right now is very complicated and very hard and actually new and isn't on youtube so i thought this would actually work i had a team that we got put together and we actually tried doing this just to see if we can actually hit it but a few things you have to do here is you have to place the shield perfectly in the right spot, which that actually looks pretty good. You hop up on the shield. Oh, come on. You hop up on the shield, and I still can't get it. I, I don't know if I have the placement wrong or what am I doing wrong here. It's pretty simple, but I need to hurry this up because the care package that is over there is going to despawn and not let me get up. If you can't already tell, I'm trying to go up here and trying to just like strafe over to the care package. And if you do it perfectly, you get on the care package and then you jump to the roof and you're on top of Hackney Yard. I want to actually take the care package though if I can. Come on. Yes. Okay. I got the care package. So that's perfect. All right. Now they're going to have no idea what I did besides the fact that they're going to know I threw a care package over here, which I know they're going to be trying, but they might think that I got like inside the truck or something else over there. But this is going to be our spot for the second map. This is going to be good. I think I might just lay down and I don't know. They might be able to see me through the windows. I, I don't, I don't even know at this point. I'm just going to lay down somewhere and figure this out, but let's get down to that 20 minute mark and let's see how this second round is really going to work out. Hopefully we don't have any more cheaters that want to cheat.
Now with time finally winding down to the 20 minute mark once again on this second round of finding no game. Um, yeah, I'm freaking out still. It, it doesn't matter. I'm still freaking out. First round was crazy enough, but there's the 20 minute mark right there. So they're going to be firing their weapons up in the air and coming at me, trying to find me and also take, also take me out of here with their melee weapons. And it's going to be a given thing. They know what I was doing because it shows up on the mini map that a care package was dropped right there in that position, but they don't really know where, like that little arm that's sticking out the crane. I don't think they're going to know that, but... I am going to stay hidden right here on the roof. Wait a minute. I can already hear them. Let me crouch. Let me crouch right here. Yeah, see, they're already shooting. So let me crouch, like, back over here, actually, because, like, I think if I lay down, they can see my body through the roof. And I'm really hoping that's not a thing right now, even though there's no way they can jump all the way to the top of the roof and melee me. But at this point, with the players we have in here, I think anything is possible. But right now, they better be throwing down the ammo boxes and also have on restock just to get their points up to get care packages and, uh... I think it's going to get pretty crazy in here. And if one of them crushes me with a care package, we get the automatic win. But clearly enough, I can't just walk underneath it. I have to be standing in one spot. If it lands here, I'm not moving because I'm going to try to get this win today. If it's a firing squad or not, they're placing shields. They're already figuring out something. Now, with a little less than 10 minutes left remaining in this right now, they haven't figured out anything. If anything, they think right now I'm inside the truck right down there. I I'm not in the truck. I, I don't know why they would ever think I was in the truck. I think they think I was doing um, shield turret method, which I'm not. I'm not doing shield turret because clearly enough, I used the care package to get up into this spot. I want to peek over really quick just to get them. But you guys know the sticks. The range on the sticks are absolutely insane. And I really don't know if I want to make myself like known and show myself like where they know where i'm at because i see in the comments all the time you guys are saying no game just hide in one spot don't move because they're gonna know where you're at well th where's the content like you can't see anything you're looking at a tin roof all video and maybe a window here and there but we're gonna do it i don't care I don't care. We've gotten so many ultimate full flawlesses on this Call of Duty. I don't know about Cold War. I don't know how that's going to go down, but we have gotten so many in this game. I think it's time that now we lose a few of them. I'm not saying I'm throwing the game or anything, but I really I just want to do it for the content. Let's see where this lands really quick so it doesn't land on my head because I really don't want to get taken out this way. I'd rather them do um like a firing squad or something, but yeah, see, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they think I'm inside the truck. I'm not in the truck. I'm on the roof. <laughs> I don't know how. You're never going to figure this out. This this spot right here, this is first game material. I should have came here first. With about three minutes left remaining, I think now's the time. Now is definitely, see, they're throwing grenades. Like, they, come on now. These guys, they can't get a break. Well, I can't get a break with them cheating, throwing grenades. So, you know what? We're going to make this even better. We're going to the very top of the map now just to make it more. Why are they shooting so much? Like, you know, none of those things work what you guys are doing right now. None of it works. Like, he's a shield turret. He's got a care package down right there. Glocktopus. They're over here trying stuff. Like, look, I'm right here. I don't want to slide off. Off. If I slide off, I'm be very upset. So we're going to back up just a little bit. And like one of them, can we like, hello? Oh, I have a crossbow on. Oh my, oh my God. They, they have no idea. I can't, I can't shoot my gun up in the air just to let them know that I'm up here. Oh yeah, they know. There we go. There. See, they're taking shots at me. Like, can we have one finding no game where players don't cheat by shooting me and stuff like that? Like the firing range is okay. Or the firing squad, not firing range. The firing squad is okay, but they need to set it up. This is, uh, this is not how you set it up. Look at that guy. That guy's insane. Now, it is uh, awfully quiet down there. So, I'm just going to check again to see if they are doing the firing squad. Yeah, they're doing the firing squad. Yeah. They're setting it up. There's only a minute left. Why can't you guys just let me win? I don't know why you have to do the firing squad. Okay, you know what? Do it. I don't care. Do the firing squad. Do it. Whenever you're ready, FC. They just fired so early. Copycat taking me out of here. Congratulations on getting that win. Well, no, actually, I got the win because that's the end of the game. There's nothing left to do. They shot and killed me, so I get the win due to the firing squad. Let's get to our next map and see if been winning this very last round of this finding no game to get the ultimate full flawless now here we are guys on our very last map to get this ultimate full flawless because we do know we had that one player cheat off the start by saying all that stuff that he was doing but i i respect the guy no hate to the guy for uh telling me straight up that he was cheating but in round two they did do the um i'm doing this wrong I'm doing this wrong. They did do the firing squad on me, which led to me winning once again. So we have potential right now to get the ultimate full flawless. Hopefully it's going to be happening, but we do need do need to hit this glitch this glitch is very complicated and very hard to hit because you got to hit it just right the old way you used to be able to do it is you used to be able to just go right over the fence right there but now you actually have to go over the wall so i might need a minute to myself 
to actually try to hit this glitch because it's kind of hard to talk, drive, and come up with what I'm doing unless I hit it right here. Out of pure luck for the Finding No Game episode! Yo, oh, man, you gotta hit the like button. If you haven't already hit the like button, hit it now. Now, now, I thought I was falling all the way through the map. Hit it right now because we are going absolutely off. We are underneath the map. As you can tell, they're driving around ATVs. I don't know why they're driving around AT ATVs. They should be lined up, but yes, this is what we're doing underneath the map. I'm staying on the ATV, and hopefully one of them runs me over because that doesn't count for a win. I'll jump off the ATV if I have to, if someone gets close nearby, but let's get down to the 20-minute mark, and let's see how this very last round is really going to work out for us. Now, with the 20-minute mark slowly approaching on our final round of this Finding No Game, I love how I can see them right in front of me right here. It's amazing. But there's the 20-minute mark right there. So they're going to be firing their weapons up in the air and coming after me. And once again, like, look. This doesn't make any sense. While I'm underneath the map and they shoot, it tells me where they're at. Like, I understand the last dude. Like, someone in here has a glitched out weapon or a glitched out something. Because if you have a glitched out weapon, sometimes you can hear it shoot right next to you. When it's not even next to you. But why is it giving me the little yellow, yellow things? Like, it doesn't make any sense at all. But like I said, though, off the start, they did see me uh, hop on the ATV and come to this certain area. But as of right now, there is a bug. I have a bug going on. The ATVs don't show up. You see them on the ATVs. On the minimap, though, it doesn't show up. It's kind of broken. It's kind of weird. I don't know really why it's doing that, but I, I'm fine with it. As long as they don't know that I'm, I'm underneath the map, I'm stuttering because I want to get this ultimate full flawless today. As long as they don't know I'm underneath the map, we should be fine. So I'm going to look in this general direction right here. If someone hops over that railing and comes underneath the map, I will know and... um. I'm getting out of here. I'm driving away as fast as possible because I want this ultimate full flawless today. With over 11 minutes in this right now, uh, we have a problem. None of the ATVs are showing up on the map and uh, I can drive around and do whatever. The ATVs just don't show up. So they have no idea where I'm at right now. Let me just like park out here really quick to see if they start driving over here. I don't want to get off the ATV because it might like, it might blow up. But yeah, see, they have no idea because I can see players right there. They're just running around the map and jumping around. And I, I, I still don't know what's going on because I still have this bug where it shows them like a yellow circle over them. Show me where players are sometimes. I think like I was saying, I think somebody in here, I'm not saying it's insane. Okay, we can't point fingers here, but I feel like someone in here has like a glitched out gun or a glitched out class that kind of shows them where I'm at and gives them a general idea but I can't look this is the highest I can look up I can't tell if someone's standing like right on top of me looking straight down cheating and not knowing how to get underneath the map by, by far this is the easiest glitch today because you just hop over the wall with the ATV and then you drive underneath here but 10 minutes remaining in this I they have no idea that I did an ATV glitch they think if anything I'm just hiding on the map because I didn't call in any score streaks or anything today yeah, this is, uh, this is getting a little insane. They might have think that I ran outside the map again, but we'll have to wait and see. Now, with only one minute left remaining in this final round, to get this ultimate full flawless today, I, I'm looking right at the glitch right now to see if, if anybody drops down in here. The music amped up again. It scared me. I'm going to shoot my gun, though. Wait, can I shoot at them? No, I wish you could shoot it at them. That would be so sick. If you can actually, like, get a hit marker on one of them from, like, underneath the map right here. I'm going to get back on the ATV. So it, does, it doesn't blow up. Is yes, somebody finally made it out here. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> like, nah, it's not happening, Chief. You can try again. I'm not letting this happen at all, ever. You can chase me all around, do whatever you want to do. Nah, you're not going to be catching up to me. I'm not letting that happen. As Look, he's right behind me, like, Mad Max trying to take me out of here right now what i'm going to do is though i am going to have um if, if i don't die i'm going to have the cheater insane go to the melee battle with me and if he takes me out i will let him win in all this he's right behind me i can hear him meleeing like seriously right behind me with three seconds left remaining that is going to be it congratulations to myself on getting that no. win to take him out of here no. <laughs> look that's no. insane right there no. i think yeah that oh, is insane once so again right in front of me so i'm not going to say the guy's cheating oh. but what a coincidence he's right there in front of me oh, so man. close right there let's get him to the melee battle with insane and see who's gonna win in all this today now here we are guys in the final round i guess you could say with uh i'm insane the cheater that got me in the first round so we're gonna go ahead and say if he kills me right now he's uh he's gonna get the win i don't usually do this but this guy i feel like he deserves the win whenever you're ready come on in i'll push you you push me i'm gonna be sending you a friend request if you kill me oh man oh man i'm nervous i'm nervous <laughs> You, I'm nervous, dude. Well, it's already over. I don't, I don't know. What it's already mean. over. You messed up. You messed up. You messed up. No. Yeah. 
Yes! Oh, I made like dude. just in time right there. I'm insane. In my eyes today, you still won, but the full flawless is still there. Great job. Great job today. So sadly, guys, that is going to be in today's video. I really do hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Modern Warfare Finding No Game Edition. Absolutely amazing. On the first round, with uh, we had a cheater. He was cheating using a thermal scope and everything like that just to spot me and see where I was at. I was wondering why the little circles kept popping up. It must have been him in a glitched out class knowing exactly where I was. Still, an amazing episode, and I still want to give him a chance in winning in all of this. I thought it would be a nice thing to do, so smack the like button just for insane on getting this far in the episode. Trying as hard so in doing whatever you can do just to get that win even though we had tons of other cheaters that were trying to stay on the down low with everything it didn't really work out for him but if you guys did enjoy today's episode and voted for me no game to win in all of this today on episode 101 of finding no game smash that like button and let me know down in the comments and i'll see you in the very next episode of modern warfare finding no game my name is no game later yeah.